Hey y'all, welcome to another video from ReckonOut.com. So today I'm going to show you how I make a simple arrow holder for target shooting out of PVC. So the reason this tube is green is it's actually a drainage tube. The diameter is slightly different. It is 4 inch pipe, but you just want to make sure whatever tube you're using, the flange that you use uh, matches. So I just cut an 18 inch section. I do cut slowly because I don't want the blade to drift in the PVC. And then just get some sandpaper and remove any burr. I actually remove the sharp corners on the edge of the pipe too, just so the, the uh, arrows don't scrape down it as I put them in. So once you've done that, you're going to take your floor flange, and I just take a rubber hammer and, and hammer it in. You want it to be tight. Um, if you use a white PVC, the diameter is slightly different. You can put a screw through it as well to hold it in place, but I use this drainage tube because it's nice and tight. So with the flange in place, what you want to do is take your heating gun and evenly heat the outside of the tube. And once it's nice and kind of shiny, you can take a glass bottle. This is an apple juice bottle. And you can shove the 4-inch pipe onto the bottle to make a lip. And this is so the arrows will not, you know, slide out nice and easy. So as a bonus, I'm just going to show you how I paint mine in camo. Just get some dark paint. Uh, cover it. You don't have to have perfect coverage. The underlying green actually helps. And then put some tan stripes. And then what I like to do is take a cargo net. You can get this at a, like an auto zone. And with those light areas, you can then put some low lights in by spraying with some black paint. Then I'll rewrap it, do it again, spray with a different color this time. And this kind of gives that uh, cryptic uh, camo pattern. I just paint it this way because, um, I don't know, the green kind of stands out and this just looks nicer. You obviously don't have to do this. Uh, some might even consider it a waste of time. But this is the effect you get at the end. Um, so a lot of things I'll paint. This is actually the same paint job I put on my climbing sticks. So that's really all there is to it. Uh, you can make these pretty quick and they are pretty useful when you're shooting target practice.